we have semifinal number two featuring the table toppers Sweden taking on Japan in our feature. Second end of okay. Sweden versus Japan. And Anna Hasselborg, it's close who shot. And Hasselborg needs to get this one to the forefoot to get one for sure, measure for a second. Nockenhauer, Malberg, casual with it early, but it will not get there. Comes up short. And it is just a single after the measure. Fourth end, and Japan had been guarding the whole end, protecting shot stone. Hasselborg gets to it, now chasing that stone in the button. Trying to get to it to tap for one, have enough push it back, and it is Sweden scoring two. And a pressure shot in the fifth. Japan trying to set up for a multiple point end, unable to, and now facing four. Akue Kitazawa has to hit the eight foot, this one made by her front end. Ishiguka Matsumura to the eight foot and a single point. Fifth end. Seventh end. And a tough shot. Freeze not quite perfect. And the quiet tap. For Anna Hasselborg and well managed by the front end. Guide that one through. They tap it and get a big two. Eighth end, Japan just unable to get that end set up. Kue Kitazawa has to draw for the single point. Japan just not able to muster any offense with the hammer. And nine facing a couple of Japanese stones. Japan needing the steal, but Anna Hasselborg again. Playing that quiet wage, managed by her team, called by Sarah McManus in the house, right to the nose, and a single point, and a three-point lead into 10. And they would run Japan out of stones, 6-3, the victory for Sweden. They are off to the gold medal game. Anna, congratulations. That seemed like a very complete performance. Did that feel that way to you as well? Uh, yes, both yes and no, like I, I made some misses early there and I'm just very proud how the team just kept communicating and we, we just made the shots after and looked forward and I'm very proud of how the team performed today. Tell me about the influence of your new coach Wayne Madon, what he's brought to your unit. Yeah, like no one has more experience than Wayne and he has uh, won the Worlds in more than one position. So he really can bring some experience and that is very, comes in really handy in this situation. So he's a great, great uh, influence. Now you're into your second consecutive World Women's Final. You've played Sylvana Terranzoni many times over the years. What are you expecting tomorrow? They are a great team. Whoever is going to play the best, and it's going to be of the smallest margins. We just saw how it was in the European final, and yeah, it's going to be a great battle. I'm looking forward to playing them. Well, congratulations and good luck in the gold medal game. Thank you so much. Hey! 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 Hey!